<clears throat> What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Thomas Gallery and Alright Time to talk about it Now For those who don't know What I'm talking about How To deal with trolls How to deal with trolls Now For those who have been following me recently and have seen the video that I made called why I became a Freemason right for those who know the video and they've seen it you also seen hold on you also seen a lot of comments on that video some people like my video. Other people disagree with my video, but they enjoy the content nonetheless. And they actually, they, they, they disagree agreeably. Then you had individuals who were flat out rude and mean spirited and just saying vile, disgusting things to me about the video. And we're saying just this horrible thing that I will not read what they put. Like I said, if you want to find out what I put, just go on my go on that particular video, why I became a Freemason, and just read the comments. Right? And you trust me, you will know which ones are the good comments and the and, and the troll comments. You will know. So I did a video a long time ago about it's, it's, it's called Internet Trolls dot 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 this is a warning and the video was about me telling these internet trolls to pretty much you know be easy be easy because none of my videos are based on negativity whether or not I agree, whether or not I agree with something none of, none of my videos are based on negativity I don't do negative videos. I don't because it just I don't have the time for. It. So what happens is my videos are positive. I do art videos. I do videos about most of my videos are artistically based. Okay, I may add a little bit of science in there, a little bit of history in there, or there's some commentary about you know, what's on my mind. But none of my negative base. Not so. The same thing goes with my Why Became a Freemason video. My Freemason video is not a negative based video. It's simply a video about why I joined. That's all. That's just the history. It's the history of why I joined. It's not the history of Freemasonry. It's not a history about you no know, me exposing any secrets or whatever. It's simply a video about the history on why I decided to join. Okay? Nothing negative about it. Those who watch the entire video will know. Nothing negative about it. So I knew that me doing this video would bring about mixed reviews, mixed reactions. I knew that. I knew I would get some people who liked the video. I knew I would get some videos, I mean, get some comments about people who disagree with the video. Even though they weren't dis disrespectful, they disagree with the video. That's fine. I don't mind that. I also knew that I would get some comments from trolls. And the comments about from the trolls... Are the, are the most, are, they're more troll comments than anything else. I get a lot of love because I get a lot of love from actual brothers in the craft, you know, who like my video. I have yet to get a negative comment from an actual Mason about my video. I've yet to get one. All my videos, are, uh, all my negative comment video, all my negative comments are from people who aren't from Masons, who heard conspiracy tales about Freemasonry, well, who never actually took the time to find out for themselves, actually join a lodge to find out for themselves. So I got a whole bunch of negative comments, a whole bunch of trolling, who would just say things that had nothing to do with the video. Like, I would get comments that had nothing to do with the video whatsoever. Nothing whatsoever. I got called a nigga. I got called a coon. Uh, I even got called Uncle Tom. All that stuff. I got called stupid brainwashed, 
all these negative things. It had nothing to do with the actual video. So, I knew that was coming. And see, the reason why I was, I'm not, I'm not tripping about it because internet bullying, see, the thing is, I'm from a particular era and place where, I'm from a, I'm from a, a time period and an era where there was no such thing as internet bullying. I grew up in the 80s and the 90s. There was no such thing as internet bullying. There was no internet back then. So, when I come across this internet, this internet bullying, it doesn't, it doesn't bother me as much as maybe someone else because when when people went back when I in my younger years, my teenage years and young twenties, in my childhood, the bullies you knew who the bullies were. If a person was trying to bully you, you knew who they were. Okay, and when they confronted you, you either ran away, you either, you know, kind of let you no know, let them bully you, or you fought back in some kind of way. You either fought back with words, or you fought back with hands. But that's how we dealt with bullying back then. So to come to the 21st century, in the social media era, and encounter the internet bully, for me holds no weight because I deal with the internet bully how I would have dealt with a normal bully. A normal bully, I would actually, we, I either, because 9 to 10, a, a normal bully would try to tell jokes about my height because I'm, I'm five feet tall. They would try to tell jokes about me or try to fight me and it's either we, t- we, we crack jokes back and forth or we scrap. Simple as that. So, I, I personally laugh at the internet bullies, the internet trolls. I laugh at them. Because I know that nine times out of ten, these are teenagers, young kids, with uh, with computerized, you know, avatars and stuff like you can't even see their face. The profile ain't even real with these with these fake names that aren't their real names. And I know that because of that anonymity, they feel as though they have the right to say whatever they want. And there be no consequences because you can't see them, you can't find them. So therefore, you can't confront them to come to their face. Okay, you said this about me. I'm hearing your face. Say it now. I know that the internet troll won't do that. The internet troll will never say, "Okay, here's my address. My here's my real address. Here's my real name. Come see me." The internet troll won't do that. They won't. If you put a fake name of someone else that that that's not even, that don't even know you. I know nine times out of ten, you're not a real, you're not an actual person. It's not your real name. I can't confront you. So you feel as though you can say whatever you want to, and I not respond, or you feel as though I, you feel as though you can say what you want to, and I, it may, it may affect me so much where I cry and you no, know, no. So what I decided to do, what I decided to do, say, so you know what, the next person who decides to troll me. I'm going to have some fun with them. I'm going to show them a side of me that very few people know. See, those who know me, who actually know me, friends and family who know me from years ago, know that I love to tell jokes. I love I love to joke around. I love to crack jokes. And those who know me also know that if you decide to tell jokes about me, if you decide to crack jokes on me and try to tease me, I am very good, extremely good at telling jokes back at you. I am very good at that. So, I say to myself, the next person, the next person who decides to tell, who decides to try to troll me and tease me, I am going to take some time out of my day and light into them with jokes. I, sh- you know what? I w- I want to read one of my res- one of my responses. I want to read it. I do. Let me see. Let me see if I can find something. Let me see if I f- see if I'm feeling feeling like I want to want to want to drop something on right quick. Let's see what I got. Let me see what my 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 earliest one. <clears throat> Let me see. 
Let me, let, me, let me show you all how I get down. Okay? Just for those who think it's sweet. Let's see. Um, let's see. Well, should, should, I, should I really do it? I don't know. Because I don't want to give these trolls any shine. Plus, people can act, people can just go on my my that video, you know, why I become a Freemason and just see because most of my comments on on my face on my YouTube my YouTube page it's on that one video that one video that goes to ten thousand views with a whole bunch of comments. And I'm trying to see, should I actually? Hmm. Should I do it? Because when I tell you I cut into these fools, when these fools decide to act stupid with me, I cut into them. I I go to work on them. Like it's it's uh some some of my best work. Some of my best well not really my best work, but let's see. You know what? You know what? No. I'm not going to read the comments because I'm not. No, no. If any of you want to see the comments yourself, you can go on that video, Why Become a Freemason. And trust me, you can scroll down and see the trolling comments. You can see the trolling comments. Okay? So, then you can see my response. Or, or what you can do is go on my Instagram page, the Thomas Gallery, uh, the underscore artist, 1983. And I posted some of those comments on my Instagram page. It's the artist, the sorry, the underscore artist, nineteen eighty three. So that's that. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna put that in. So anyway, I have fun with the trolls because I I know that this is not real. See, the thing is, people take this YouTube stuff serious. People believe that this YouTube life is real, like. The general population thinks that shoot, thinks that when you see someone on YouTube with their videos, you think well the well the masses think that they are seeing one hundred percent of their life on these YouTube videos. In actuality, that's not true. YouTube gives you a small glimpse <coughs> into their life. Gives you a small glimpse. We we show what we allow you to see. That's what we do. We show the public what we allow to be shown. We don't show you all of our life. One, because ain't none of your business. And two, because just you got you got you got stuff to do. You got too much stuff to do to be posting your entire life on YouTube. It's too much stuff to do. So when a troll gets on there, when a troll gets on there. He th he or he or she or it because it's sometimes not even a real person. Well, they think that they can say whatever they want to you, and think that there's no repercussions for it. So, like I said, I grew up in a time where you couldn't say anything out your mouth recklessly, and think that no one was going to come for you and see you. You just couldn't do that. Okay, so when these trolls got on here. They decided to make comments, just outlandish comments about me, you know, just saying nasty, nasty things. And they thought that I wasn't going to respond. <clears throat> well, little do they know that when it comes to telling jokes, I'm good at it. I do this. Okay? So, when I say I lit into these trolls, oh, man. I did these fools dirty. I did them dirty. Dirty. They caught a 30 ball. If this was battle rap, they would have caught a 30. So, this internet stuff ain't real, y'all. This ain't this stuff ain't real. This is just a glimpse. This, this is just a business. This ain't real. And people think that this internet life is real life. No. Real life, in real life, you can't walk up to a, a grown man or grown woman 
and say these same things on YouTube, teach people in their face, and think they're going to nothing to happen. You can't say these outlandish things to a grown man or a grown woman and think you're just going to stand there and walk off and nothing happening to you. No, man, no. Real life, real life is if you would ever say anything like that to these trolls that these trolls say to these people in real life, you got your head knocked off. That's how that go. This YouTube stuff, this this social media stuff ain't real. Yeah, you got people, you got people posting stuff on Instagram and YouTube, all that stuff that ain't really their life. That's why I show art because I'm an artist. I really show art. That's all I do. I ain't no gangster. I ain't no thug posting up, you know, guns and stuff. I ain't got a whole bunch of money to flash. I ain't got that. I'm an artist, so. I show my art. I love science. I talk about science. I love you no know, current events. I talk about some current events because some some current events aren't worth talking about. No. You know, you see my face. You see my you see my face. My name is my last name is Thomas. It's the Thomas Gallery. That's my name. Okay. So you're not gonna see no fake pictures stuff like that. This is really me. This is really me, okay? You see my you see my picture on 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 YouTube. You see my the picture on YouTube matches me, so you know it's me, okay? So this internet stuff ain't real. So all you trolls going around talking all reckless, think that you can just say whatever you want to, and you just get away with it. You're only doing that because you know the people can't find you. You know people can't find you, so you can say, okay, I can say whatever I want. They don't know who I am. They can't find me. <sighs> yeah, that's cute for a while. But understand, when you trolls do that, there are people who know you. That's the thing. There are real people who know you. Okay? And I know you wouldn't say those same things on the internet as you would to that person in real life. And second of all, just because you say something to a person does not mean they won't respond back. So if you say something to me on the internet, you think because I'm peaceful and all that stuff that I won't respond. No, 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 no. You may get a response. Now, I won't respond to everything because everything isn't worth responding to. But if I decide to respond to you in the same manner in which you respond, in which you respond to me, trust me, when I respond, you're going to know. You've been hit because when I decide when I decide to respond, I don't respond to everything. But when I decide to respond, just know I hit hard. When I decide to swing, I swing early and often, and I swing a lot. So if I just ever if I ever decide to talk about you in a degrading manner, please know that you're gonna get hit multiple times. Hard. You're getting back to back to back to back to back to back hits. I'm dropping bombs on you. Seven, eight of them. Okay? Just know. So, all you trolls out there. If any of you trolls want to know how dangerous it is to troll me, go on that video. Go on the video why I became a Freemason and look at my comments. Look at look at the trolls because th- here's the thing. I don't start it. I don't start trolling. I never troll someone. I don't do that because it's just stupid. It's, 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 a, it's a clown move to me. I don't troll. I don't start problems. But know and believe I finish problems. I don't start the problems. I finish the problems. So if any of you trolls want to find out how dangerous it is to troll me, go on that video, Why I Became a Freemason. And scroll down my com- scroll down on the comments and find the comments where I'm being trolled, okay? Find those comments where I'm being trolled and then find and look for my response. And you will see what happens when I decide to respond to trolls. And two things are gonna happen when you see it. You're either gonna laugh really hard about how bad I did these trolls, or two, you yourself are gonna get very upset. And try to make a comment behind it. And you don't want to do that. 
if you see me tear a troll up, don't jump in. Don't jump in that. Don't do that. Don't be an innocent bystander. Don't do that. Do not be an innocent bystander for trolls. Don't do that. Because you see me tearing these trolls up. And if you don't want any problems with catching this heat, don't jump in that. Okay? Because if you decide to jump into that troll, that troll comment, I will tell you and the troll that I'm dealing with. Because actually, just recently, I ended up knocking out three trolls in one hit. No matter how many trolls come, if I decide to, if you decide to comment and troll me, just know I will either block you. Fine, I will. I will three things are going to happen. I will either block you. I will either report you, or if I'm feeling, if I'm feeling like having fun, if I feel like having some fun, I will respond back. And trust me when I tell you, your best options. I either I block you or I report you. Because if I decide to respond to you, you're going to be pissed off with my response, okay? Okay. So, like I say, if you want to you want to see how you want to see how dangerous I can get, go on that video because all of my trolling videos, all of my trolling videos are on that one all of my trolling comments are on that one video. Every single trolling comment I've gotten since I've started YouTube are on that one video. And there are a bunch of them. Why I became a Freemason. Or you can go on my Instagram page, the, the underscore artist 1983, also known as the Thomas Gallery. You can go on that page and see the troll, the comments that I got, and my response. And then you, then you might want to reconsider. So you know what? I was going to troll him, but the way he talked about these folks back. I'm not gonna troll him because if he if he decides to troll if he decides to comment on my trolling, it's gonna be a problem. So you know what? I'm not gonna I'm not gonna troll him. I'm gonna leave him alone. I'm gonna troll someone else's page. I'm not gonna troll him because trolling don't bother me. I'm 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 of a different age group. I'm of a I'm of a different mindset. You can't troll me and hurt my feelings. You can't hurt my feelings. You can't hurt my feelings. I'm trying to tell you, you can't do it. Trolls can't hurt my feelings. But I know I can hurt your feelings. <coughs> I can make you quit. I've made trolls quit trolling me. <coughs> That's how dangerous I get. When I decide to respond back, I can make a troll quit trolling me. Okay? So any trolls out there that want to try me, just know. Read the comments. Think before you speak. Or think before you type. Because if I decide to respond back, if I decide to respond back, you're going to wish that I blocked you. If I decide to respond back, you are going to wish that I reported you. The best thing for me, the best thing that you can ask me to do is block you or report you. Because if I decide to respond back, you're going to be pissed off in my, my response, okay? So I just, uh, just know. That's how, that's how I deal with trolls. I, I did a video warning trolls. I warned trolls months ago. Months ago, I warned the trolls. Okay, I warned you. Now, there's no more warning. Now you're catching the business. So now you might want to reconsider trolling me because it's dangerous to troll me. It's bad for your health, okay? So be easy, okay? Because it gets real. All right. And then, I won't curse at you because I you know people cursing at me, using profanity, using curse words, and profanity, profane language. No, no, no. When I decide to respond back, I don't use curse words. I don't use profanity. No. You can look at you can, all my responses that I put down. Anyone who trolled me and I responded back, you will see them using profanity, you know, MFs and B. No, I'm not going to do that. I will, I will, I will chop you down in the worst way without using one piece of profanity. You won't, you won't see a damn, a hell, a ass, none of that. You won't hear none of those, you won't see none of those things in there. You will get straight fire from me without using one single profane word. Not one. But just know that when you see what I wrote, it's powerful. Without using that, without using that one, without using one piece of profanity. Okay? So, there's no more warning. I gave you the warning. 
And if, if I decide to respond, you know what's happening. Okay? If I don't decide to respond, I don't, I don't, I don't respond to everything. I don't respond to all trolls. Some trolls, I might say, you know what? You know what, troll? I'm going to make you, I'm going to make an example. You troll will be my example. You troll will be my example. You troll, not worth it. Your, your troll is not worth it. Your troll, I'm making an example out of you. And then we go from there. And, I, and I'll make you quit. Okay? All right. So that's how I deal with trolls. I, I want to be so bad. Uh, you know what? You know what? Hold on. Now, no, 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 no. I'm tempted to so bad to read, to read some of these troll comments and my response to them. I want to so bad, but you know what? I'm not going to put that out there. I'm fighting back doing it, but those who watch it, all of you can go on that go on that video. Why I became a Freemason and look at the comments, look at the look at the troll comments and look at my comments. Okay, okay, that's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. And when you read my comments, buckle up. When you see my comments, buckle up because it gets real really fast. Okay, so that's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say too much. That's all I'm gonna say. Right. Thank you all for watching this video. Leave a comment down below. Like, comment, subscribe, and share. I will catch you all later. Peace.